Hey guys, Tyson here at Kicker Technical Support. What we're going to do today, we're going to wire up six subs in series parallel to make a total of 1.3 at our amplifier. To get started, we'll go to the back side of our subs. What you'll notice that you have two terminals. You have two positives, two negatives. This side of our sub, we have the dots. This side of our subs are the solid colors. So to get going, what we'll do is we'll take our red with white dot terminal and we'll connect it to the solid black. And we'll repeat that across the whole line. So red with white dot to the solid black. What this will do is it will double the ohm load of each speaker. So they all go from a 4 ohm load to an 8 ohm load. And once you parallel whatever's left over, that's what drops it down to our final impedance load. So that's series on all the speakers now. What we'll do now is we'll do the parallel part. We're going to parallel everything that's left over. So basically, all of our solid reds are going to be tied together, then all of our black with white dots will be tied together and they'll head out. So to get going, you need you more wire head out. And we'll go with our solid red to our black with white dot. Black with white dot. Solid red. We're basically going to daisy chain jump from each woofer to each woofer. And there we have it. So everything is ran parallel. Backside, what we did, everything was ran in series. If your box is using dividers, it's okay to go in and drill a small hole to run your wire through so that you can get to each woofer if need be. The hole just needs big enough to run the wire through. It doesn't need to be anything gigantic or whatnot. Uh, you can fill the hole full of silicone if you want. Uh, you don't have to, but if you want, you can. Like I said, it just needs to be big enough to run our wire through, so nothing too extreme. So once we get everything wired up, we need to go to the amplifier, our single output. What we do, we go to the last sub in the setup. You can use any of these woofers as your last sub in the setup. It really doesn't matter. Just pick one and stick with it. And we'll go with this one here. And what I'll do is I'll take my speaker wire that runs to my amp, and this will be my positive, which is my solid red. And I come over here to my black with white dot, which is my negative to the amplifier. And here's my lead to my amp. This will be a 1.3 at your amplifier. It's important to know what your amplifier can do ohm load wise as far as its power and whatnot. If uh, you were to take this 1.3 ohm load and go to a 2 ohm loaded amplifier, you could start running into issues where the amp starts shutting down, uh, running really hot, not working correctly. So make sure that you're at least using a 1 ohm loaded amp to run your setup with this, this wiring. So just to recap, we've seriesed each woofer by going red with white dot to solid black on each sub, and then everything else left over is all parallel. So basically all of our solid blacks are tied in, and then all of our solid reds are tied in to go to our final lead to our amplifier at 1.3. Hope this helps you guys out. I'm wiring up your six sub setup. If you have any questions, let us know. Thanks.